I'm Debbie Peverell, and you're listening to the weekly tip from basicboardgovernance.ca. This is January of 2020, and I've been talking about planning pretty much all month. We started out by establishing the vision for your organization, or you personally. What's the ideal state you hope to achieve? Then we looked at mission. How close do you want to get to that vision this year? Followed by goals. What are the individual goals? What are the strategies to achieve the goals? And then tasks. I have already said that goals aren't achieved for two basic categories of reasons. One being the goal wasn't properly set. Two being there wasn't a process put in place to focus on the goal. So we've talked about both of those things. This week I'm talking about monitoring. So you've got all this in place, you've done the allocation of resources, you've figured out the schedule. Now you've got to make sure if what you asked to have happen has happened. Any system for timekeeping or goal keeping will work provided you follow the system. People have very expensive planners, but they don't work if you don't use them. Our system, what we use, uh, you can download this from our BBG website. It's an Excel sheet that shows a week. It's one of the things we have. We also have monthly ones and we have an annual goal sheet. What I'm talking about this time though is the weekly sheet. You take that, you look at everything that has to happen for that person or for the organization during the week and you block out that time. Then you figure out what time is left over to work on the goals. What activities are scheduled and how do they tie into achieving the goals. You do this for a while and you go back and you look at the end of each week, for example, did we do what we thought we were going to do? What kinds of things happened that weren't scheduled? Were those things that help us achieve our goals? Is it possible that we have time set aside for doing activities that don't lead us to our vision? The other thing that I see happens is that people uh, put time or they put list of goals on their weekly schedule, but they don't get to them. They do other things instead. So this whole process of comparing what you thought you were going to do to what actually happened is important because it helps you figure out whether you're getting closer to your goals for one thing, but it also helps you figure out whether what you did was set some goals that aren't goals, and that's why you're not achieving.